Hi friends, my name is Katherine and today what I have for you is a beautiful spring makeup look. This look is in collaboration with Lipstick Luna. Lipstick Luna is a makeup artist just like me and she's based in the UK. She's very creative, uh, she has great looks and so we decided to collaborate together. She is the sweetest so definitely follow her and Instagram lipstick underscore Luna. Um, and you'll be amazed by her looks. Okay, so I'm really excited because literally this is my first YouTube video and I'm a little nervous. This is amazing. All right, let's get started. So I basically, what I have done already is put my foundation on and um, Fenty, Fenty's amazing. Fenty, uh, literally like I'll put it on, it'll stay on perfectly throughout the whole day. And since I wear glasses, it doesn't like crease up as much as like other foundations. So I highly recommend Fenty if you wear glasses or any type of other glasses or in the summer because it really holds up. So actually I combined Fenty with this MAC Mineralize Moisture Foundation just because I wanted a kind of like dewy, um, wet look for my look today because my look for today I wanted fresh I wanted um, something that's easy to follow for my viewers and I want it like artistic free uh, actually I'm feeling like the Coachella vibes lately especially you know right now it's Coachella so I'm thinking hey why not spring fresh Coachella vibes right but I'm going to keep it in the area where everybody could do it because I want everybody to participate and just do it. All right. So along with that, I also uh, use the Painterly Longwear Paint Pot right here. I put that on my eyelids because it'll help the eyeshadow stick. So that definitely is a good thing to wear. So let's get started. I'm going to use the blue blood palette for the first time I'm gonna actually use the blue color so I'm really excited about this guys this palette is gorgeous gorgeous this really puts you out of the box that's what I love about Jeffrey his creativity um, everything I, I love Jeffrey and so he doesn't stay within the box he's literally outside the box and look at this the concept everything is gorgeous and the colors are right here as you can see beautiful gorgeous I have an idea but the artist in me I don't like to plan look so I like to um, go with what is in my heart so I basically love to start with one of these type of brush as you can see it's really big and fluffy and I like to dip in it's like a, the color of my skin so basically what that's gonna do is that's just gonna prep the eyelid for our look As you can see, this color is just basically like my skin color. And actually these colors, like I'll use the skin colors, the light colors to wear them to go to work. I, that's what I love about this palette. You have two different options. You have like the colorful look or you have just like the low key, beautiful, soft looks. Okay, once that's done, I'm gonna grab a more precise brush um let's see uh i got this in the ipsy uh, box. it's this one right here there is a color already previously but i always use this little thing right here to clean my brushes i got that from tj Maxx. okay so i'm going to start with a untouchable which is like a soft pink color just to put it in the crease um, and tap. I'm going to tap. Let me see. I don't want. I want you guys to see, of course. And this is just like, like I said, prepping the eyelids in the sense that uh, when you do a look, um, you start from the lightest to the darkest. That's going to help build um, the look. That's going to give it um, dimension and all that. So basically tapping around the crease. So nice. It's like 70 something degrees. I literally just turned on the AC for the first time. So it's like, I'm so happy and looking forward to spring, to summer. 
I, I can't wait. You just want to go out, you just want to enjoy, everything is just gorgeous, right? <laughs> okay. So, uh, I like this mint tea color. I'm going to show you. It's gorgeous. It's like this, you know, mint green. This one right here. I was going to show you guys. I used this one first and then this one second. Now we're going to go with that green. Okay. And I'm going to clean the brush. This brush, it's um, pointy in the middle, so it's going to definitely, you see, and it's a Morphe brush as well. And I'm just gonna tap in a little bit softly because these eyeshadows ooh, are like um, somewhat loose, so I don't wanna waste a lot of product. And let's go into the outside. Oh my God, <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, so let's see. Okay, I'm so excited. Uh, and I'm nervous, guys, I apologize because this is like my first time um okay so tap tap let's do that again let's pick the extra that fell off oh oh wow okay that's what i want like i want like a happy like i love flowers so it's like happy like i don't know that kind of vibe free like Springy, of course, artistic vibe. Okay, let's tap more. I'm gonna put more because I wanna build that green in there in the outside perimeter of the of the crease. And it's actually touching inside as well a little bit. Like it's on the crease, but it's like on the lid as well on the outside, as you can't see. All right, and I want a little bit on top here too. Let's put that in there, why not, you know? We're having fun. This is gorgeous. Like, I mean, you ha it's like, you have to get this palette, honestly, because it's like, it makes you try different things. It's. I've never had something like this in my eyelid before. Wow. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, we're gonna do the same thing with the other side. All right. And for makeup, like guys, like literally, if you're just starting, um, don't be afraid. Like, go all out, like, follow your heart. That's the one thing that I always, like, strive to tell everybody. That's what I do. I follow my heart. And don't get scared. Initially, at the start, it might look crazy. It might look like, oh, my God, I did I, did, did I do a mistake? <laughs> did I stutter? <laughs> did I do a mistake? No. It'll always come together at the end. Um, it's like everything in life, you know? You, you, you have to keep going forward, you have to be focused, you have to believe in yourself, you have to be excited, you have to put in so much passion, you have to like 10X, like Grant Cardone 10X. And when you do that, at the end, it all works out beautifully. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm actually gonna put it like on, on the lid, half of the lid. I like that. I wanna expose that color really nice. Okay. All right, you could do, I'm cold. It's like the sister of minty somewhat. <laughs> so it's this color right here. I'm cold. I'm cold. All right, so I cleaned that brush and I'm gonna use the same brush. I'm gonna tap, tap softly. Tap, tap a little more. And I'm gonna use the this mirror instead. Ooh, I'm gonna, almost painted my nose. Hey, that could be a look. I'm going to put it in the front right here. So this is good about this brush. You actually could get in the corner right there and then up. Okay, we're gonna do obviously the same thing with the other eye. All right. All right, pretty easy. 
trying to match both. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna clean that brush again. And we're going to take our fingers. Let's see. We're going to take Crystal Fresh, which is a Crystal Flesh, which is a sparkly pinkish color right here. We're going to put that in the middle. And you have to tap really light because it's like really soft color. You see? Oh, wow. And we're going to, you know, put it in the middle of the eye going up. So you're going to go. Whoosh. That's gorgeous. I'm like in love with this palette. This is just crazy how beautiful it is. It's the first time I use colors like this in my life ever. Okay. Kind of colors using your fingers because it'll actually come out much more like it's like the warmth of the fingers that helps like the eyeshadows to actually look gorgeous on the eye you know mm -hmm. and you want to go all the way up to the eyebrow really cool look and so for today we're going to use let me see I'm going to use blue Monday which is like a purplish, bluish, this one right here, Blue Monday. And we're going to take this type of brush, slant it like this, and we're gonna tap, tap. I'm gonna do it on, on here on the waterline. Yeah, wow. So just tapping motions. If if you don't like to do that, just go outside and then, you know, softly like smudge it out with a brush, but smudge outside. So that way, you know, you could do that with this one. Um, but if you're like a beginner um, and, um, you know, just uh, instead of this dark color, use a light color. That way it's not so, so difficult. I'm going to get closer so you can see. You see? Okay. So, what we're going to do next is get that also that color and we're going to try to put it on top. But try to stay within the line, line not something so prevalent, I guess you could say. Um, let's, I always start in the middle and I tap because this is a really, really pigmented color. So, I'm going to start in the middle. And then at the end, try to tap. All right. Okay, now that we did that, I'm gonna bring in a different color right here in the bottom. That just pops the eyes. It just makes it look gorgeous. And I'm going to bring in this type of brush. It is the Luxie 151 Mini Flat Brush. I'm going to grab the color Flourishing, which is right here. This color, like a teal color. And just softly tap on the eyeshadow. And we're going to bring it right lower. Gorgeous. Yeah, this is really nice. Okay, as you can see, that's what I did. Okay, I'm gonna get more of that. Don't be afraid, you know? It's, it's okay to put a lot more. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna clean that brush. So, I kind of want to do something 
with that ocean ice. I don't know, should I? But I wanna do something really cool. This one right here. I'm gonna give it a try. Woo, okay. I'm gonna use this brush. I'm gonna tap into it, make sure it's clean. Make sure it's clean. I'm gonna tap into it. Oh, guys. Okay. I'm gonna put it in my crease, but the outside crease. So I'm gonna do this. I think this color is more like a finger color. Nothing happened. So I'm just gonna disregard that. I'm gonna take my brush here. I'm gonna take away those little itsy bitsy glittery stuff. I'm not gonna do that. And I'm gonna go back to my green and I'm just gonna tap that in there again. Cause um, actually I f it, the way that it works, I notice it's just, you have to use your fingers and um, that would be something that I would put like what I did with the the pinkish one. So let's just leave that. I'm, I'm going to put more green in here. This is the minty. So disregard that. <laughs> That's for another look. If you guys want another look and using that ocean ice, let me know in the comments below. And I will do it. We'll test that out. Not today. Okay. So, what I also want to do is, oh, let's do this. Let me see. Entitled. Let's try Entitled. So, it's this one next to the ocean ice. And I want to put that in the corner of my eyelid. So, tap, tap, tap. It's picking up. All right, let's do that. Let's put that here. Ooh. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. This one, and we're gonna, and we're gonna take this brush, clean it, and we're going to just make it part of it. Tap, tap. So it looks like it's part of it, part of the eye look. What do you think? Yes, no? Okay, I wanna mix it with another color. Uh, Cullinan? right here so it like mixes really well so it doesn't look block like blocked like a piece of like color in there and that doesn't be long yes okay perfect that's exactly what I want you want to tap tap as much color of that one as you can this color works very well on top of other colors And let's bring it up, why not? Bring it all the way up here. It's different. <laughs> all right, so we gotta do the same thing with the other eye. Okay, clean the brush, put Cullinan on top. Yep, all right, let's see. And you want to pick that cullen in again why not we'll pick that cullen in again we're going to use the same brush and we're going to put make sure it's clean it's only picking up that color we're going to put it right here so that's just gonna give some height to your eyebrow pull it up you see no need for surgery or botox <laughs> pull it up I think this is it. Let's see. It's just like so exciting to use all these colors. I want to put more sparkle in there. Let's see. What can I do? More sparkle. All right. Um, hello. I'm using Heavy Metal Urban Decay. And this is in Distortion. So I want to put right here. Like, I don't have enough sparkle. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, this is so pretty. 
how gorgeous is that? And we're looking for like a simple look. Um, this is really beautiful because the glitter on this is like green. Green. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go on top of that minty where I started and where it ends. So, like that. And I'm going to do the same thing with the other. I just want to like fill everything with, with glitter. <laughs> Take me to Coachella. I've never been to Coachella, by the way. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, this is gorgeous. I'm like, this literally makes me so happy. This is so pretty. Oh my god, like I want to do everybody's makeup now. <laughs> Alright, I have to match with what I just did here. Obviously, I'm right-handed. Sorry, I'm covering myself because it's like I do one side and the other side comes out a little different because I'm just like right-handed. Okay, so I literally like went up a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna use an eyeshadow as a highlighter. Okay, I'm gonna do that. And we're going to use Cullinan. Let's see. Tap, tap, tap. Okay, guys. Oh, oh yes. Let's, I'm gonna try the other side to see if it literally has like blue tones in there. Probably does. gonna go here on top this is beautiful I think it I literally it like man I just want to use my favorite brush and we're just gonna make sure it's mixed well softly you know I also want to put like highlight on my nose. Mm. Let's use that eyeshadow again and see. Okay, coloring in. It's very white, but it works. And I always like to put right here my cupid's bow defines the lips like makes it look so cute all right we are glowing this is really nice yeah all right mascara my favorite mascara this one right here by maybelline really good buy For lips, I want a pink lip, like a soft pink lip and glossy. One, this is from Patrick Star. This is lip gloss. Cool. If I'm not queen, something queen P lip gloss. I got this last year. Hmm. I feel like I want to put something out. I want to try this Ciate Glitter Flip. Really dark. I want to take a napkin. I want to like a flush of color. I'll be back. Like that. And this is how it came out. <laughs> Am I done? Oh my god, I think I'm done. So this is my look, spring collaboration with Lipstick Luna. Um, 
I hope it was it's easy to follow a uh, fresh easy fun colorful inspiration is flowers Coachella and just happy vibes happy 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 vibes thank you so much this is exciting I actually did my first YouTube video <gasps> If you really like this video, please let me know. Do a like, um, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you think. <laughs>